nightmare games. <laughs> What's up guys, the fans here from Primal Games, so welcome back to another classic, classic Nightmare Games trailer. And now you guys are going to play this game with me. Um, the Siege, um, let me tell you, I've read about it, they told uh, in the reviews it was the most curious game out there. So I actually went and purchased it and tried it myself, and let me tell you guys, there's been moments, there's been moments um, that I regret playing this game at that stage but uh, I'm gonna play this today um, I'm gonna have a couple of parts in this so this is part one um, guys so check this out and let's get the ball rolling so if you are ready get some popcorns going get a drink and then uh, kick off with me and let's play some scary scary stuff um, alright so um, let me just get started here and uh, Go through all of this gory stuff that they they're warning me about here, um, and let's start playing. They say research is a very hard, patient, the uh, through investigation, and so it, yeah, it is a hard game. You you know you, you guys gonna check it out. I'm gonna be traveling um, through the levels and see what I can find, trying to unlock some sort of secret so let's see what's happening here in the intro here um sad square studios are the guys responsible for the heart attacks um during the um, playing of this game so let's get started so check this out I love it when games start like this, um, have some sort of a mysterious intro towards um, what's happening here. So, um, I know there's a couple of friends of mine that doesn't play horror games at all. Um, they just plain simple to scared to play it. Uh, I like to play it, I like the scariness of it. But I do regret playing it afterwards every time. So this guy is still loading his weapon here. So I think he's gonna be, he's about to shoot something or someone. Um, looks like um, there's a lady or somebody coming into vision here, guys. So um, this might be the murderer himself. I hope I'm not playing as the murderer here. That won't be um, so sweet. So, um, yes, a shout out to my friends, um, White Shadow um, and Kaul. I know Kaul is not playing um, these type of games, you know, um, even with the lights on and you have 50 people in the room. So, uh, oh my goodness, this guy is going to be taking out somebody here. Wow, this guy is literally taking out his family or something. Yeah. I like the way they move the camera away so you don't see the real hardness of um, him shooting the, his family. But man, oh man, that is harsh. Right? That's really all oh, right. Here we start. So, we see it here. Let me just get my stuff ready. I've got some lights on around me, guys. So, uh, and I've uh, moved the door, closed it up so that nobody can give me a fright from behind or something, which might just elevate my blood pressure towards a um, cardiac arrest, and uh, I might get a heart attack or something. All right, so um, I'm limping here, and I guess I'm not dead. So, um, all right, so yeah, I'm starting off. I've got a room up here. It looks like some candles and stuff is up here. Some ritual or something, maybe. 
might be in here so let me just check a look in here see what's happening here all right so um, this is a progress room I would like to stay here my whole gaming experience I don't would like to go out and explore the house but I reckon I have to go and do it and um, this is where all the crap starts going through and down this scary house now hmm. hello Twain it's Rose your neighbor I, I know it's late and I know that I tend to be a little anxious about small things I apologize for that but I'm getting a bit worried I haven't seen you out of the house in about three weeks. Is everything all right? Could you call me just to let me know everything's fine? All right. Bye-bye. All right. So, um, geez, lady, have you been spying on us? Um, hello? Uh, I thought I can phone for a pizza or maybe the ghostbusters or somebody to come and check this place out but uh at um at uh doesn't sound so I, I reckon that means i've been lying there for about a couple of days now um a week or so i hate it when it's so dark like this um, let me just get this lights on here oh um uh, all right i'm gonna move quickly through here and this shows that whenever i get into dark spaces my brain will start playing tricks on me or something um i'm definitely i'm definitely not going to go down there right now um i would like to have something at my oh uh, so you see exactly this is how it starts so once the light goes off and the param paranormal activity starts beginning to spin around and uh, so um, I've got a, some sort of a, there's some keys here my hands on this keys maybe slip it in through the door and get out of the house or something so let me just um, do I grab this thing oh, there we go and this is the Loris chapter. All right, let's get out of here. I'm gonna go to McDonald's. No, I'm not gonna go to McDonald's. Uh, I want, don't wanna open. So let's get up the stairs here. Now this is some creepy, creepy. Look at, look at it. I, I don't wanna go down in there. I don't wanna go in there. There's something there. I know there's something there. <clears throat> yes, let me roll take some pills here, guys. Alright, let me see. I hate it when a bathroom curtains are close like this. I always, I've watched The Shining. There's always stuff down there that jumps up on you. Alright, let's go in there. This looks like one of the children's rooms. I, I think this guy took them out. One of the child's. Um... This is a child's closet, so I'm telling you guys, this place gives me the creeps, the creeps, the creeps, the creeps. I think I will must come and play this, and um, I'll I'll make a video of him playing this, give a couple of shouts out and stuff like that. <clears throat> Oh, this is dark. This is wasted lights. Wasted lights. Wasted lights. Wasted lights. Wasted lights. Ah. Okay. I always like the lights to be on. Um. What's in this room here? I have to go and check it out. Um, it's also very dark to my left here. Where's the lights? There's a light there. Let me just switch that on. Check that out. And 
And uh, no, I think games like these um, horror thriller type of games really is amazing playing them. I like I like playing them. Um, I would like to play them with a friend. I'll get some of my buddies into the studio here and uh, we'll play that in the near future. Some horror games. Um, but some more games coming up. I should check that out if you can. And, um, you know, this, this when the slots and stuff open, it reminds me of that uh, Resident Evil games when you get to the door, it opens it, you know, it cracks like that, you know. And, uh, <clears throat> But this one's, luckily this one's don't have that cracking sound to it. But um, the problem for me is there's too many doors in this house. And uh, so I don't know, there's nothing I saw there. Let me just move on here. But there's another room here, so let me just enter this room here. And uh, let's get the lights going here as well. All right, there we go. So this is the uh, this is the main bedroom. It looks like uh, a little bit untidy. <coughs> um, taking it from this guy, destroyed his whole family. If it's the same, if this this is the guy, um, we can just check out here. This goes all the way to the child's room. Okay, so I've got a closet between the two rooms here. Very interesting. So I take this chill pill here. I think this is a chill pill, you know, just trying to. Um, I've got a lighter. Okay, so where's the smokes? I don't see any smokes. I'll tell you, I'll make my own smokes when I'm in a situation like this. Crack one day and, you know, just start smoking my way out of there. Something like that. I reckon something like that. Um, all right, let me just check out. Let's just put a lighter on. I'll put it, switch it off. All right, let me just go. It's a little bit weird for me holding this stuff like this, but okay. Let me take that one away. Let's go down here. Yeah. I think I've, um, I've checked what I can check on there. This door still can't open. This one also doesn't open. And uh, let me just see. Uh, go all the way back. I've got my light here, so I'm going to switch that on. Let me just get down here and see. And I can't get it. It's a basement key. I've got some writing on here. I want to. I want to see my friends play this thing. I reckon they're going to have a fright of their life. I did play it before, and uh, I actually didn't didn't get very far. It was too scary for me, so I had to. Uh, postponed that uh, gameplay and I decided to replay this um, but uh, my first level was a little bit more different from this one so let me just get back up here <coughs> now look at that look at that why is the light off I'm, I'm not I'm not uh, okay let me I'll, I'll switch on the, the let me just check if there's something here I don't see anything here my brain is like there's some stuff here but I can't put my finger on it let me just return I've got heard something there there's nothing there there's nothing there and this thing is closed again. Who the hell closed this, this thing? I don't like this. Every time I'm gonna come, come in here and that thing is closed, I'm gonna have like a shout or something. I'm telling you guys. This is really, really starting to creep me out now.
some candles, but I burned out. I'm going to use that. <clears throat> I shall let me tell you guys. It's down there. Now look at that. Look at that. Ooh, 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 ooh. What? What's? Just run. Ah, now this thing doesn't even work now. Ah, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm. Uh, uh. No, 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 no. I reckon I'm gonna leave here. I'm gonna leave this place here. I don't see anything there. No, there's nothing there. And that door closed on me. Let me just open this thing up again. Right, guys. Um, until then, part two, one is finished. Uh, check out part two coming on soon. I'll see you again. Cheers.